Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of talk through what I was doing here. It's just going back to the paragraph that I previously had written and created um, and doing a little bit of touch up. So now I'm just moving into the revision. And again, this is sort of like a script and what I was thinking I would say if I was in a recruiting position. So I definitely started out with the things that I love to do to help you know, this imaginary recruiter understand and frame sort of me as an employee and what I want. Um, then, you know, I just went back to the original paragraph and pulled out some of the important parts. So talking about how, yeah, I hold these degrees, which this recruiter is going to look at my resume. So I didn't need to sort of waste time um, with the specific degrees, just letting them know that I do have those um, basic technical qualifications for the career that I was really talking about and discussing. Then I threw in, you know, a quick example from one of my internships. Um, so that was just kind of what I am writing out now. Okay, and then um, I popped over to my LinkedIn and my portfolio to make sure I was getting the same language and kind of checking for anything else that I might need. And um, this is just really to be try to more consistent across. <laughs> okay, so now moving on to the elementary day. So of course this is a different audience. Um, and so I need to, oh, and there is looking up what, what 10 year olds are there in fifth grade. But um, I wanted to really change the language, of course, and the tone to be a lot more like exciting and kind of focus on the creative aspects that might speak more to a fifth grader. Um, you know, talking about like stories and, and characters and really, you know, emphasizing the things like the videos and the articles. Um, you know, obviously I didn't lay down these specific degrees that I have because fifth graders don't care or really necessarily know about majors and programs. So I just kind of focused on like, hey, I had to keep going to school um, and here's kind of the classes that I took. So that one was pretty quick and easy because you don't need to spend a lot of time being technical with a fifth grader. And then lastly, for the acquaintance, kind of the same idea as I did with a fifth grader. Um, you know, it's keeping it pretty like vague in general, because again, in this sort of social and party situation, uh, you know, nobody is really that interested in specifically what you do. So I wanted to try to keep it, you know, to just kind of the fun, broad things. Um, so now I'm opening Grammarly, so definitely make sure to download that and you kind of see how it works. That similar to just like the word checker, uh, red underline is something that's misspelled, green is grammar. Um, here, I'm just kind of editing and adding a few extra things in. Talking about, you know, what I value, especially with that curiosity piece on my, my LinkedIn. You know, talking about how I really want somewhere that will send me for more professional development. Again, to help recruiters place me better. You know, and some of the grammar things, um, just like any other spell checker, Grammarly's not perfect. So you need to make sure to go back and kind of use your own principles and thoughts. Thank you.